Where do you do your best thinking? The flirt. Hey, welcome back. It's Kevin and welcome to my series, The Freestyle Fire Journal. If you're new to this series, basically it's for people like myself who really suck at staying consistent with journaling. It's also for uh, people like myself who hate journaling by themselves. So I kind of created this series for me, but I'm pretty sure there's other people like myself who uh, want to be journaling as well. So this series is actually inspired by that. Now, if you're new to this series, basically what I do is I read one question, uh, one question from this one question a day journal. If you want to follow me, make sure to um, pick up your copy at refugeehustle.com slash journal and uh, you can follow me along. And no worries, if you can't pick up your copy, you can just comment below, just write one or two sentences. Take, take some time out of your day just to sit back and relax and journal with me. And it's a great chance for me to get to know you and you to get to know me. I think it's a great dynamic. People have been loving this series uh, offline. I've been talking to a few, few of my viewers offline and it's really great. And, and before we begin, I would love to do a shameless plug. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell button to make sure you stay tuned to these daily episodes of the Freestyle Fire Journal. Now, this, is, this question is August 15th, and the question is, where do you do your best thinking? This is a great question because I typically, so when I was, there's a, typically a few places that I really love to do my thinking right there's three three places that really come to mind in terms of this right so first of all when i wanted to do uh organization and get my shit together right because typically what i like to do is every sunday i want to kind of set the game plan for the rest of the week and set the intention set the strategy plan out my week uh and one of my favorite places to do it before quarantine obviously because everywhere's closed but one of my favorite places to do it was actually inside a local coffee shop. And now I'm not talking about a Starbucks, right? But I like independent coffees a lot. That is something that I'm a little bit bougie in life about. <laughs> and I just, I just love the ambiance of a coffee shop. And that's where I do most of my organizational thinking, planning things out. Uh, I'll, I used to do like daily, if you follow my Instagram, shameless plug, Kevin of the refugee underscore each after each word. But basically, uh, I used to kind of do my writing posts there, like for Refugee Hustle back in the day. I used to write my Instagram stories there and stuff, or Instagram posts there. Um, both things that I probably should consider doing again. But essentially, what is really uh, great about it is just like when I would drink my coffee and sip on it and just be in that environment where everybody's like working on their own thing. I get my best like ideas uh, for for structure, for strategy and stuff. So that's one of my favorite places to uh, get my best thinking. Now, the second best place where I get a, I get the best ideas is actually out in nature. And this would be really weird. This is more during quarantine. But what I used to love doing is going on this hike, uh, going on a hiking trail and um, uh, what I would do, there would be a few, three things I would carry. Obviously a pen, right? Um, I have this like Dr. Grip pen that I use a lot. It's rugged. Uh, I have a Mont Blanc pen, but honestly, I don't like to bring it out that much into the wild. But this is my daily carry pen. You can tell it's really beat up. But I like to bring this. I also like to bring my five minute journal. Uh, shameless plug if you want to get a copy. Make sure to check out the description below. And I like to bring my tone notebook as well. And the tone notebook is really great because one of the things I love about it is that the pages actually ripped out. Oh, like you can rip them out and actually put them back. If you look very closely, they're like D ring type of things. And you can just put it back. You put it back like this. And. Basically, they don't fall out. And that was my old airline ticket, by the way. So, um, I like to do that. And I lied, there's one more thing. I love to bring a yoga mat with me because typically I'll go out into nature, uh, write down, and I go on a hike by myself. And then I like to do yoga and then journal a little bit. Just think about anything that comes to mind. It's free form journaling. And it just gets all the creative juices, right? I get my best content ideas out during that time. Uh, I also get like a lot of marketing angles. It's really interesting how a walk out into nature is very restorative and you just get all these creative 
uh, creative thoughts too. Now, the third place that I really love uh, do my best thinking, it's kind of like in the shower actually. You wouldn't believe it. It's actually one of the reasons why I have something like my S10 over here is because I can bring it in the shower and if there's anything that I want to uh, write down or anything like that, I can do it because <sighs> There's something about showers, showers where you get your best ideas from, uh, and it's it happens. I mean, if you if you're new to this concept, check out Shower Thoughts on Reddit. That is a great place to get your best ideas. Surprisingly, uh, and one of my favorite pastimes is just doing um just doing like shower thoughts uh or like reading shower thoughts on Reddit because they have these very stimulating stimulating mental like thoughts as well that, that people randomly have so it's really i love it it's really solid now notice with all these all, all three places it's like i do my best thinking when i'm alone not to say i don't thrive in group environments or anything like that but there's something about you know going out in the world and kind of decompressing for a second like taking a step back putting all the pieces together and that's how you get your best ideas you know um it's, and and another thing is like all these things is just like you're not under high stress environments like when i was in pharmacy i wouldn't get really great creative ideas when i was hustling in the pharmacy or i wouldn't get creative well i sometimes do get creative ideas during jujitsu but you're more focused on the task at hand rather than the more passiveness and letting kind of like the muse hit you as well um so basically that those are all the great places that I get my creative ideas from. I uh, love to throw the question back at you. What are, uh, what are, where do you guys do your best thinking? Is it on the crapper while you're taking a dump? Is it, um, is it on long walks? Is it when you're at the beach or something? Love to kind of hear what, what specific places that you love uh, to do your best thinking. And as always, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell button for the sh for daily episodes of the freestyle fire journal sorry i blanked out for a second so make sure yes hit the bell uh to stay tuned for daily episodes of the freestyle fire journal and guess what i'll see you guys tomorrow take care have a great rest of your day peace